Hey, what's up everybody out there in YouTube land? Eric Ferris here once again on the motherboards.org YouTube channel. Got another unboxing for you folks. One of the guys out there said that he couldn't actually see the box sometimes. I was trying to show the front and rear of the box, so I'll go a little bit slower at that time. Today we're looking at the TZ68 Plus from Biostar. So I'm gonna go ahead and set this board over here. I'll have the camera and totally zoom in and lock onto the front of the board. Okay, I'm gonna spin it around. I'll have him re-zoom in so you guys get a very clear shot of this. For those of you who complained out there, just wanna make sure you guys can see it. Now we're gonna go ahead and unbox the board. Now Biostar is a company that does a lot of stuff for the mainstream. They don't do a whole lot for the you know for the, the mainstream industry. They're more of a channel partner, I need me to say, but uh, but they are a company that supports some really good motherboards. This one supports the new Intel Z68 chipset, has all those features. I'm gonna open it up, start off with this. You can see right inside the box. We have the SATA cables, and then we have a Molex to standard SATA power cable. We've got the rear I.O. Move the stuff out there. We've got the user's manual. And then we've got the driver's CDs. This is all that stuff. All the basics that you need. We're going to go ahead and pull the motherboard out of its package. It comes packaged pretty well. Now, Biostar's motherboards are always priced for the enthusiast to be priced at a very low price for you guys to be affordable. This motherboard is going to be in that same range. This board will probably only be like in the $100 range. So let's go ahead and add Mr. Cameron. Can we go ahead and move that up? This is the motherboard itself. You guys take a look at it. It's going to feature the same stuff. You know, 32 gigabytes of DDR3 memory. You got SATA 6 support right here. Well, SATA 3 with 6 gigabit support. Your standard SATA 2 point there. Board's pretty well laid out. We've got a couple of restart, reset switches on here. Um, you can see we've got two PCI slots, PCIe rather, and then two PCI slots, standard thing. These slots are pretty well far apart too, so video cards should actually be able to have some cooling. All in all, it's kind of a simply laid out motherboard, but you can see it does have Japanese capacitors and low ferrite choke. So it's not really, you know, a junky board. I'm going to just flip around and let you guys see the rear I.O. This board is really geared for more for somebody who's doing a media system. As you can see, the rear I.O. is very light. We do have all the stuff for you, though, for hooking up your, your monitors and stuff. You have both your DVI, your standard VGA, and you also have an HDMI port. You have all that stuff on the rear I.O., but it's pretty much geared just for people who are doing media centers and stuff like that. This is not a high-end board, but this is everything that comes in the box of the new Biostar TZ68 Plus motherboard. This was the unboxing. We're going to have a whole bunch of Z68 motherboards coming out, so follow along. We show this to you coming up here on the motherboards.org YouTube channel.